and we're going to show you how this simple step can save you time and money. What's up everyone? Welcome, Welcome back, back to Team Kelo What? Today we have another DIY for you. Very, very simple. is how to make a mask out of regular hey. household materials. So today we're going to use a regular paper towel, a couple of rubber bands, and a stapler. And we're going to show you how this simple step can save you time and money. What if you don't have rubber bands? We'll show you an alternative to making these incredible masks. So stay tuned until the end. Let's get to work. All right, so the first thing that we're gonna do, we're gonna take a paper towel and we're gonna lay it on a flat, clean surface. And we're gonna start folding it to get that shape, that mask shape that we normally see those other masks. So basically you take it from one of the angles and you fold it inward like this, All right? And then you keep it going. Basically what you wanna do is you wanna keep on folding all the way until you get to the end of, whoops. So basically you wanna keep on folding until you get to the end of the paper towel. Right, I'm gonna continue, which is gonna look something like this. Once you have that shape, what you're gonna do is you're gonna fold one of the ends inward, right, like so. You're gonna put a rubber band around it, and you're gonna take your stapler and you're gonna put a stapler in between. Then the next thing is you're gonna take the other end and you're gonna make another fold on the other side, like that. Then you're gonna take your other rubber band and you're gonna put it in between. And then you're gonna take your stapler and you're gonna staple it like so. Now, what you wanna do is you wanna unfold the paper towel a little bit like this and move a little bit forward so that you can have, you can uh, measure it and put it around your face. All right, now that we have our shape done, Basically what you want to do, you want to expand your paper towel a little bit and push it forward so that will fit your face. And you just measure it and put it around your face. Make sure you're covering your mouth and everything else. And voila! Oh, very nice. So one of the things you can use this for around the house is when you're painting, when you're cleaning, if there's some dust or something like that. But if you need to just go out and do a quick shop, this is not a protective mask, okay? This is a simple barrier. You can also double the, the paper towels yes. if you feel that you need a little more protection. But wait, there's, there's more. more. Oh my God, I don't have a rubber band, Alex. I can help. How? <laughs> so the way you can do that is using very, very simple tooth floss. Hmm. There you go. So all you need to do when you're measuring it out is basically you want to cut a long piece. You want to measure it so that the distance from your ear to your mouth sort of, here we go. And then what you want to do is you want to tie a knot on the other side. Hmm, interesting. I have another piece right here. So I'm just going to take it. I don't need to measure it just to kind of eyeball it. Similar to what you now made, I'm going to use a paper towel here and let's get to that part. So I'm gonna follow sort of um, the previous one. I'm just gonna do this, fold it in, fold it out. Once again, folding it in, turning it, folding it out. And keep doing this until you get to the very, very end. Once again, and here you go. Same thing as you did before. You're gonna take a paper towel, you're gonna create this side here, once again, staple it, turn to the other side, same thing, turn it in, and okay, and there you go, voila. Just find the right size and then tie a knot at the end. Once you finally got into your ideal size, okay, and you put it on, and then you put it on this side right behind the ear, and there you go, there you have it. Have my own mask, how about you put your own mask? Let's have a mask off. Who wore it best? Did you now wear it best? Did I wear it best? Let us know in the comment below which one, which one do you think is more fashionable. All right guys, so that has been a little DIY on how to make a mask from a paper towel. I hope you guys liked this video. Make sure you comment, like, subscribe, and hit the notification bell button so you don't miss any of these amazing videos. So get to mass making and we'll see you on the next one. Signing out, Team, Team Kelo What?
Okay. But isn't that my side? It's OBF size now. That's usually my side.